So hello there and good day guys. So right now is we are going to use this website ClickUp for our task management. You need to go on this website and then log in for free guys. And so this is the dashboard of the Click app. So as you can see here, these are some of options and then you just need to go here. So depending on you, you will be able to see here on this side the home. The inbox, the documents, the dashboard, the clips, the timesheets, and then many more. And then right here is your workspace. So these are your spaces here, guys. And you are going to add a space here. For example, to that is, let's name it a uh, task management or management. So for example, to that is this one. And you can also add a description. And then you can also choose a either you want to private it or invite members. Then you just need to click on that continue and then you'll be able to find here define your workflow and then you just need to tap on that create space in order for you to proceed to the next step and then after that one guys it's you will be redirected to this page where you will be customizing your space and then at this left side guys you'll be able to see here create folders then here you can also see it here the projects and management here you can create a list a document of the form whiteboard folder from template and then import and then for you guys you just need to tap on this from template and then here you will be seeing here different types of templates here by click up so you can search a template here or look for a template types here as you can see here there is the click up templates and then template types you just need to mark check if you want it or not and then after that one is you can see here below is the complexity so either you're a beginner intermediate or advanced and then you can also search the template guys for example so that is task management then you just need to click enter and then you'll be able to see here templates by click up and then it depends on you guys which template you will be using so for example so that is this one the project management the simple task management here, I'm going to use this one, the task management here. So let's try to scroll down, but I'm going to use the task management. So you just need to tap on that one. And then as you can see here, this is the description of the template. And then tap on this blue button, use template. Right here, guys, is you need to fill in your folder template, which is you'll be able to see here your folder name. For example, to that is, I'm going to name it first task management. And then where should this folder be created? So you can either choose management and then team space or your management. So we are going to use this workspace management. And then after that one, you can also choose if you want to import everything or customize it. So let's try to customize it. Or it's good to go. So here you'll be able to see here in the next part is a project date. So import as is or remap dates. You can also include archive tasks or no. So it depends on you guys. And then after that one is, you'll be headed here to your workspace of management. And the first thing you will be able to see here is the recent documents and then the bookmarks. And then here is the list guys. And then the board. And then here is your sample task. And then you can also click this add button guys to see here. So... These are some kind of view, the list, the gun chart. Then we'll able to try the table. And then here, let's go back to the board. And then the overview here, you can edit here. So you'll be able to see here the folders. And then at this tree button, you will be able to see it here. And back at this board, you can add a task here. You just need to tap this add button. As you can see here, add task. And put a task name depending on you. Here is your task one, guys. And then you can now edit this card. So you'll be able to see here your activity. So who created this task? Who is assigned on this task? And then after that one, is you'll be able to see here the do. Or it's up to you if it's in progress so that is the status of this task and then you can also change here the dates you can set the dates the starting date and the due date and then the time estimation you'll be able to see it here and then after that one is the tags it depends on you guys if you want to fill in it and then this one you can type an email here for you to assign someone on this board and the priority is 
So let's try to put origin and then the track time. And then here is the relationships. So at this point, guys, is we are able to see here add to this task. So we can paste any link here. So this is a type of relationship here, guys. And then you can also add here description. And then below here is the you YouTube. For example, to that the description is YouTube script to be done and then after that one below this one is the custom fields where you will be able to create custom fields and then sub task check please assign comments and then the last one is the attachment then you can also drop your files here to upload you just need to tap on that word upload then if you are done you just need to see here you can also add to convert to task type You'll be able to see here some options if you click on the tree button. Then here is the new feature. If you want to be reminded by this activity. Then here are the some options and then archive. And then delete. Then after that one, you can also add it on your favorites. Or minimize the task. And then here is the switch layout, the activity. So... Again, we are back here and then you can exit, guys. And then right here, guys, you'll be able to see here search. You can search any task here and then customize. For example, to that is you want to customize your customized view. So as you can see here, this is still a different kinds of views. And then after that one is here, guys, is your automations. You can add a automations here, which are integrated in this template. And then after that one is you can see here that after that one is you can also type here so you can search run a command or ask a question so you will be able to see here all of your tasks then after that one is you just need to x that one and then let's go here at this side where you can create new items here is the icon of new and open a task you can open a notepad you can also record a clip here guys or this new feature which is a create a reminder and then after that one is you'll be able to see here create a document then quick action menu and then your account where you can edit your profile or anything then after that one guys is you will be able to see here on this side still different types of views and then here is also a view this gun chart we can also add a gun chart here and then here is an example of the gun chart here guys and that's it so back at this overview guys you'll be able to see here all of your tasks and that's how you use clip up for management